What's going on guys? Uh, yeah, you're, you're looking at this right. I am vlogging. I'm giving it a shot. Uh, I'm going to a White Sox game tomorrow, so I figure I want to go get a jersey and I don't want to wait till the White Sox game to get it. So I'm going to go find one at a Dick Sporting Goods somewhere around here. It's going to be a little you know, process. So take you on the journey with me and then we'll also show the White Sox game later on in the video. Yes, I'm in my house. House tour is going to come later. I still got to do uh, some more stuff before I really want to put it out there. But you guys will see it soon. All right, the lighting in here is shit, but I'm in my garage right now. So I got two Dick Sporting Goods that I'm going to try. Hopefully the closer one actually has a jersey in my size, but according to their website, they don't. I'm still gonna give it a shot because it's like, you know, it's barely out of the way. It's kind of on the way. And uh, yeah, I might have to hit two Dick Sporting Goods. There's also drops going on on Twitch this weekend. So I got to get back pretty quick to uh, to stream. But I don't know, man, I'm excited for this White Sox game. So I really want to get into this. But I haven't been to a baseball game in over a year. Uh, the last one was actually when I was down in Texas, I went to a Rangers game. That stadium's sick, by the way. They were shooting off fireworks in the dome. I, I've never seen anything like it. It actually scared the absolute hell out of me. But I've been to Guaranteed Ray Field many times, but it has been a few years. I've also never owned a White Sox jersey. I figured it'd be pretty cool. I like the look, you know, the, the black. I wear a lot of black anyway. So even though I'm a Cubs fan, don't get mad at me, Cubs fans. I like all Chicago sports, so I am going to support the White Sox, especially against the Marlins. And the last time I saw the Marlins play was actually at my last Cubs game at Wrigley Field. Jock Peterson hit two home runs. He was still in a Cubs jersey at the time, and the Cubs lost like 11-2. It was like Jock Peterson, and that was it for the offense. Ideally, I want to find an Eloy Jimenez jersey, but I'll also go for Tim Anderson, Lou Bob, or even Andrew Vaughn or Kovac. I don't care, but ideally... I get an Eloy jersey because he was at one point a Cubs prospect, and it can remind me every day of that horrible trade for Quintana. All right, Dix. What do you got to work for me? Come on. Yeah, I'm not going to lie. It looks like it's all kid stuff, and they don't have much in terms of jerseys. I think we got to go to the next one. Mission failed. We'll go next time. Oh, look at that. I can stand you on my car. Dude, I feel like a real vlogger right now. Uh, so I drove like 20 minutes. So the camera moved. I drove like 20 minutes to get to this Dick's and they had literally like nothing. They might've had like one adult jersey. It was on like a third rack up, so I couldn't even reach it. Uh, it really unfortunate. So the website was actually right. Who would have thought? Uh, I got to drive another half an hour to get to a different Dick's. This one for sure is supposed to have at least the the Eloy jersey, I want to say. If not, also uh, a Southside Tim Anderson. I, I want one of those City Connect jerseys if I can possibly find one, but I don't know if I'm going to be able to. At least we'll get the Eloy one though. So I'm going to have to take a drive down the road about 30 minutes and uh, hopefully we can have some luck. I'll tell you guys this though. I never thought there would be a, a, a world out there that I'd be working this hard to find a White Sox jersey as a Cubs fan. But uh, I'm, I'm doing it. I'm here. We're, we're doing this. All right. Let's see if this works again. Oh, look at that. That's just beautiful. I'm, I'm going to enjoy using the car like this as a stand. All right. So drove another 30 minutes. That was an eventful uh, Dick's run right there, but all in the end, we were successful. As you guys can see here, we got Eloy. Hopefully you guys can see that. Dude, It that was a process. I'm not gonna lie to you guys. So I get there and I thought the website said that Eloy was, was an option that they had there. I'm not seeing it anywhere on the racks. The only double X I'm seeing is, uh, is Moncada, uh, Southside Jersey, but Actually, you know, afterwards we find out it's actually an XL and the, the hanger was wrong. But I have this guy check for me and then have him go in the back. It's not on the rack anywhere. They don't see it in the back. And then randomly I see it in just like a random rack. I'm like, wait, that looks like a jersey. It says 2X. I pull it out. It's the Eloy jersey. So we get that. I'm walking up to the front with this guy. He went to the Sox game yesterday. I'm going tomorrow. Um, so he got to see Lou Bob walk it off. Uh, what would have been um, today's the 10th. So the 8th and the 9th. I think the ninth. So that was pretty cool. They were playing the Marlins too. I, I just realized I could see Luis Arias play tomorrow, which is sick considering he's hitting like 400 this year. I get up to the cash register. This guy, it, it, this guy plays Valorant. <laughs> I'm like, yo, hold up. This guy's ascendant. Turns out he's not even good enough to make his college esports team. They're all immortal and radiant. The, the, the college around here, Purdue Northwest. I, I I I did not realize that every single college, even the small ones around here, is esports now. I'm like, yo, his, one of his buddies is getting a Rocket League scholarship. The time, dude, I graduated a few years too early, man. I I wish I had esports around when I was in high school and college, but dude, this is crazy. 
Got the jersey though, that's all that matters. Tomorrow is gonna be a blast. I'm gonna take you guys along with me. I'm very excited. All right, so we're about ready to go. It is the next morning. I'm not gonna lie to you guys. Well, first of all, this, this White Sox jersey, this, this feels wrong. This feels wrong in so many ways, but I did kind of fuck with it, I'm not gonna lie. Check this out. So it's cold outside, also dirty mirror, ew. So I gotta rock the sweats. I wanted to rock some shorts, right? But I got the full Nike fit, Nike jersey. Got the Nike sweats. Got the white Air Maxes. This ain't bad. I'm gonna get a hat at the game because you know we can't we can't show this hairline off the entire time. But long drive there, not really. About an hour, hour and a half with traffic. I uh, should get there about an hour before the game, and we'll you know we'll be good. I'm excited. Also running a little late. I didn't eat or drink anything, so it's a it's a protein bar and energy drink kind of morning. Shout out Ghost. I'm not sponsored, but they make good stuff. And we're here. Pretty easy drive, about 45 minutes. Not too bad. All right, I'm in. I'm way, 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 way early. So uh, find the section and explore, I guess. Little Louie. MLB be the show legend right there. Yeah, I got here way too early. I haven't been to a baseball game in quite a while, actually. I'm very pumped about this. Uh, none of the snapback guys are here yet, but uh, hopefully we'll get uh, Jack and Casey on camera. But for now, pretty empty. Got Gio, Zevi throwing a bet. Look at that man. Dude, he was like close. Dude, he's way taller in person too. I also, I don't know if it's uh, the way he wears the jerseys or something, but on, on TV, he's definitely a lot more bagger. Like he looks trim as hell today, I can't lie. Tall as fuck though, man. Like, right, yeah. 6'8 looks real in person, you know what I'm saying? All right, here with Snapback, Jack here. Would you tell us a little bit about Snapback Sports? Snapback Sports, we're taking over a section behind us. Right here. It is raining, so there's a little less people, but there will be people here. Yeah. But Snapback Sports, we're a sports media company. We love going to live sports. We're the biggest sports Snapchat account, and we are the best, absolute best MLB The Show players yeah. in the world. <laughs> Snapback Gaming on YouTube. Right? Yeah, I've been watching their stuff. It's good stuff, man. It's really funny, entertaining. It's oh, it's hilarious. Not that we're good. It's we're fun. No, it's hilarious. It's hilarious, bro. Um, and we're doing the five days, too, yes. right? Yeah, so this is day three of five. So we're going to every AL Central game. We're having 50 people come out, get the whole community out. We got a big surprise coming. Did oh. I tell you what it is? You have not told me yet. Okay. What we'll do you think see. it's going to be? Well, I don't know. Maybe, maybe some type of tour or something? I don't know. It's, it's tough. It's, it's tough. a good one. It's a good, it's a good one. one. I'm Stay excited. Tuned. I'm Stay excited, tuned. bro. Bob. All right, I think it's the third inning right now. So far, no runs. I need to find a Chicago dog, though. I haven't had one of those in years. So I'm going to take a little trek and find someone here. Ooh, that's got to be it. Gio just got out of a huge jam, but we were on a mission during that. And we got it. Chicago Glizzy. No onion, of course. Onions. I haven't had a Chicago dog in years. I'm very excited. Hey, yo, Joey Chestnut, the Glizzy Ian champion. I'll smack this shit out. Worth the $9. Get a beer, too. There it is. So that surprise Jack was talking about is someone's getting a trip to the World Series. I have gone through two rounds. We've made it. We're about to do a game of rock, paper, scissors. I'm not, I, I don't know. I don't know. All right, post rock, paper, scissors. Top 16, sweet 16 made it out of everybody for a chance to go to the World Series. I went rock first round. We tied. It was sudden death. And I went rock again. I won. So lead eight. We go to the Elite Eight, I switch it up, we go to Paper, won that first try. So I am in the final four to go to the World Series. One more Rock, Paper, Scissors game away from going to the final contest, and I blew it. I lost. Now the guy that I lost to is going to the final contest, which is a hot dog eating contest. He's got to eat, beat someone else, eat the most hot dogs, and then there's a final Blue Bob just came up to bat, uh, and then to distinguish between all the five different stadiums they're doing, they have to run around the entire stadium and the fastest time goes to the World Series. I was two things away 
for potentially going to the World Series with Snapback Fam. By the way, got the sick hat. It's got a pin in there. Pretty sick. We're enjoying a good game. Had a couple beers. It's a good time, man. Uh, right now, I believe the White Sox are winning, but we got to see Soler hit over a home run, which was sick. By the way, I'm going to enjoy the rest of this game. Maybe grab one more beer, and then I will talk to you guys in the car. See you guys later. Daisy! Daisy! Solaire to sit his second of the game. <laughs> Foxy is our champion of Chicago. Now he's going to run a lot. Run a lot. Run a lap around Guaranteed Rain Field. How are you feeling? How are the laps? Hey, they're feeling good. We've been waiting for his moment. All right, what time do you think you're going to post? Under a minute. Under a minute. Okay. I love the confidence. Oh, no way, Casey's chasing the whole way. <laughs> but he's got to run a lap around. You guys saw it right there. Casey is chasing him with the camera. If you guys want to see the full footage, go check out Snapback Sports' vlog. It'll be up, I don't even know when. It's probably going to be a little bit. But once it is up, you guys will see in this app, way after I post this, I'll make sure to put a card at the top of the screen for you guys to see. Otherwise, just go keep periodically checking Snapback Sports' YouTube. You'll eventually see it there. Oh, he's motoring. He's motoring. Come on. Yeah. Two minutes. <laughs> I think she's you say it all. But 2.43. Good time. That's good. Hey, I'm, I'm, I'm confident about it. I'm confident. All right. Hey, I I'll said, take it. Hey, I said over three. I'll, I'll take it. I said over a minute. That is a really good time. The intern is out of breath. Is Shout it? out to Foxy. Let's <laughs> go. Stay Let's tuned go. to see who wins the ticket to the World Series. Let's go. Let's go. Job you. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Okay, that was sick. I'm not going to lie to you guys. I'm in the car right now in the parking lot. I'm waiting for some of the cars to go out. So I figured I'd talk to you guys for a sec. White Sox game, three beers consumed, 
a dog, a Chicago dog, which I love. I, I love Chicago dogs, man. I miss them. I'm very excited to be back in the area again so I can eat them again, you know, when we go to the games and such, because I will be trying to go to more games, more IRL vlogs. For those of you wondering, if you haven't seen a vlog before, uh, I'm gonna be trying to do more of these. When I go to events and things like that, like the All-Star Game coming up, I have a whole week trip planned with a bunch of other creators and such. We're gonna be doing some stuff. I'm definitely gonna be trying to vlog some of it. But meeting with the Snapback Boys, Jack, Casey, they're sick. Casey won eight and a half grand. You guys saw that on that hit. He had a crazy parlay. I think he said it was a Soler home run, a Robert home run, the over, which was eight and a half. Uh, De La Cruz RBI is the one you saw and an Arias hit. That's a crazy parlay. He read the entire game script, basically. Absolutely insane. We got to see Jake Berger. We're mutuals on Instagram. I saw him hit a double. It's pretty sick. And that snapback competition for a ticket to the World Series is actually, that was sick, man. I've, I really enjoyed that. Made it to the final four in Chicago. Now that guy that ran the lap that I showed you guys earlier, his time of running the lap around the stadium is gonna be against the other four stadiums that they're going to. So they've already been to two. They went to Detroit and Cleveland, today is Chicago, and then they're going to Kansas City and Minnesota. I don't remember which order that they're doing. But out of those times, the best time around the stadium is gonna take it to the World Series. Super dope idea. I'd love to do something like that at some point. I, I don't know when I would ever be able to make that happen. But hey, you never know, maybe one day. But look out for Snapback's vlog. It was, uh, it, it's gonna be a good one, man. I really like their content. If you haven't watched their vlogs, check them out. I'll link them above. And hey, you never know. Maybe we'll collab with them in the future. Maybe do a little MLB The Show. I'll let you guys know. Hope you guys enjoyed the vlog. Leave me some feedback down below. I really wanna do more of these, so I wanna get better at it but I gotta drive home and then we got drops on Twitch that I gotta handle. So I'm gonna go live for tonight. Busy content day, but it was worth it. Had a lot of fun. I'll see you guys in the next one.